Hey John, it's the Isles of Scilly. Out there? Yeah. You can jet out soon as well, today. Lovely. So, we're only about four miles from Land's End, which is kind yeah. of around the corner. Yeah, it's just a little bit around the corner. Yeah. And, yeah. Isles of Scilly, well, Brisbane's, Isle of Scilly, USA. Pretty yeah. much. Or pretty, Canada. pretty much, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Hi everybody, thank you very much for watching. For watching, we ain't watched yet, but thank you very much for coming to try and watch. We're trying to play golf. We are at Cape Cornwall Club today, and uh, we're playing the back nine. I am one up. And for some reason I'm exhausted. I don't know why. I don't know. Heavy weekend, I think. Here, isn't it? Well, no, we got a buggy, but it's just one of those tiring weekends, mentally yeah, and everything. Yeah. So I am still one up, which is good. I'm hanging on here a bit. Last hole was a bit of a disaster. Yeah. But There's three more holes to go. Yep. Three goes three more to go. Yeah. The view is still wonderful and the delicious. The view is still wonderful. As always. Yeah. And uh we're gonna crack on. So this is hole 16, this which if I can check 16. is about a long way. Hang on. 365 yards. Yeah, see, this is what I'm having problems with now. I just can't see. I really can't see. 365 yards and par par four. four. So T is just here. And you're going out straight up the fairway there through the wall, up the hill, and your flag is out over there. Sorry, a bit wobbly on the zoom. Yeah, it's kind of near the near the wall this way yeah. all the way along, isn't it? It's a good it's a good hole. Yeah, and what you don't want to do is be over the wall. No, you don't want to be over the wall. That bank. You've got a left to right sloping fairway as well. So it does slope left and it slopes all the way off down there to the side. So we crack on. So you know what? Let's let's do it, John. Let's just do it. Shall I hit the ball for once? Go on, start you you, you hit the first shot. Let's see if I can see it. It's such a lovely evening to play golf. Okay. That's gone. It's on the right. Cleared the, cleared the wall and everything. Yeah, right. you cleared. Yeah, just a little bounce to the right. That'll be alright. Happy with that. Yeah. For once, I had a decent tee that shot. That was a good tee shot. Okay, you go get your club, mate. I'll go get my club. I don't know why I parked the buggy so far away. He's not the best buggy driver in the world, honestly. Should have seen him going over that bridge. There's a little bridge we drove over earlier. Um, While well, we wait, my eyesight is not good right now. Had a optician's appointment with John Eva, who's been on the channel on the golf day, and uh, it's, my eyes have got worse. So we are we've gone off contact lenses. We're changing from contact lenses back to glasses, and I'm just waiting for some new ones to arrive. Then we should give them a test. Right. Do you know? What? I think the wind's gone. I think the wind is gone completely. This is so rare. Super rare for for Cape Cornwall. Wow, you've hit that a little bit right uh, left, mate. I'm not zooming in. Gone over the second wall. Gone over the second wall, so you might be all right. Yeah. You go. Yeah, I didn't zoom in because I thought it might have gone over the first wall. First wall was out of bounds. Out of bounds. But yeah. You clear the second one, you're down by the next tee. True. So, bit of luck. You're over on the second. Sometimes your power just gets you away with, doesn't they? I know. If I'd done that. It'd have been straight in there. Yeah. Nice little practice area here. But um, obviously not good when you're trying to hit off no. this one. Okay, so we carry on, and uh, you'll find that again. You've got to chip over a wall again. Oh, I've got to play over a wall. You're good no. at doing this chipping over walls, like, aren't you? I'm not. No, you're not. I'm really not. <laughs> well, Joe, you just found the right rough here. Yeah, and it's curled down the slope, which we kind of expect well, yeah, everything you can't... slopes this way. So I'm just going to keep going further up. I'm going to aim for that yellow marker and just keep going further. Yeah, up. I think off the yellow marker because it will roll to the right. That's a beautiful strike. That should be very good. That, that should be all right. That should lay you in a nice little position there, a little yeah. pitch down to the green. So, while we're here, Neil, yeah? I will say, in Neil's defence, Neil is the buggy driver for the I'm, day. I'm the right? Neil is also trying to drink an energy drink at the same time as being a buggy driver. Well, my, Neil, my power aid. State of you. I don't know. Look, 
No, 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 I'm not necessarily so embarrassed. You oh know. no, it's my Powerade. <laughs> I don't know why you wanted to rub it in anywhere, but oh. obviously it works for you. No, go and find your ball, mate. Oh, that was terrible. Now, Neil's looking over the wall again. Again. Because he needs to work out where he's got to go. Uh, you're actually between the yellow tees and the red tees for the next hole, which is up there. But you are over the wall. Yeah. So, but you you did not go in the out of bounds area, which is behind no. that wall. So you've done well with that bit. All right. It's a shot into nothing. It is a shot, shot into nothing. Yeah, but I'm, I'm blind filming a blind shot. I can't shot. take it too close to the wall. In no, line. because you've got to get over the wall. Yeah, but then over the other side of the wall is a slope to the right. Yeah. This is fun. Yeah. Um, I'm just trying to think where to film this from. I might try and go to the wall. If you go to the wall, you'll get a view of the green. Yeah, that's my hope anyway. All right, so it's just, just literally sort of a three quarter, sort of 52. Yeah, so very quickly, there's the green. There's my ball. There's the green. There's Neil. Right. Come this way and hope. Come on. On the green, rolling off the green. Oh, on back the back edge. edge. Back edge. I'll I will it. take that off. You certainly will. There we go. Lovely. Well done, mate. Five bit of shot. So, Nils is driving the buggy back through. I, I'm just thinking about this hole. I'm, I may do a dinky nine. A little dinky chip and nine. run, yeah. Nine, nine, yeah, I think so. Hit it on the left hand side. Got enough power to roll on the green. Caddy duties. Caddy duty, buggy duty. I'm quite a good caddy. Can't play golf. You don't get 10% nothing, right? 10 of nothing is nothing. That is, that is true. Mm. Now, you it's, can see it's going to go right to left. It's going to go left to right, sorry. Yeah, it's a serious, it's just a tricky one. Because if you, your wedge it, you're going to go too far. Yeah. I don't know. So. Wait, it's too soft, it's going to just roll back in here. Got to roll. Too soft, I think, just too soft. Oh, come on, get over there. Go on. Just drop. Drop. No. no. Oh well. That, it was the intention was right. Yeah. It's, That's, yeah, not a thought it would have been on the green. It's fine. It's an ounce or two, is it? Yeah, we carry on. It's all right. Happy with that. I'm not down in the dip, which I could have done very easily with a with a dodgy wedge chip. We're probably looking at this about three foot short. Three foot short where I need to be. It's fine. I think it's about three foot short. If I got another fine three foot, it would have rolled on. Yeah, the yeah, it's not far off. No. So you're going to putt this one then, John? Yeah, I'm going to putt it. I think, again, you've got to stay left, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, not didn't hard enough, but no. It sounded like you caught the grass a little bit caught behind the grass that a bit one. With it. That's always that worry when you're putting on any kind of yeah. fairway, isn't it? Really, but uh, it's okay. It's down there. It's okay. We keep going. I haven't lost the hole yet. Not yet. I will say that was a bit of a miracle shot, of yours. That was fantastic. Well, mate. fantastic, especially any, after the struggles you have with that other wall. Yeah. Earlier. Anybody who think I've played from over there before? Well, <laughs> and you probably have. <laughs> right. Bobble, but uh, uh, take it away, mate. Thank you very much. Yeah, no problem there. So, do I have a shot? Do I have a shot to go for something? But I'll we'll check the abacus a minute. Let's check the abacus. Neil's got on his fingers. Lucky there's not that many shots to worry about. <laughs> I'm trying to try and think what you've hit now. One, two up. After he's done Three his fingers and his toes, he gets oh. 20. So you got, got a putt for five. You got a putt for five. So I got a putt for five. You got a putt to. Just to half a hole. 
Yeah, now you wish you were a bit stronger on the other bits, you know, on that bit and this bit, yeah? Yeah. Uh, so yeah, you got a putt to half. Yeah. Oh. No. No problem. Right, so. Yeah, it's going so well, mate. Yeah, you, you're I'm still playing so well. well. And now I'm not. So, what are we now? Level? We're all square. All square. I was two up at one point. Two holes to go. Sure, I went three up. <laughs> we go to the seventeenth. Right then, Neil. So we're back to all level. I've kind of not capitulated, but I don't know what's wrong with me. Mentally, I don't I'm know just... what went on on that tired. last hole. Um, yeah, we're. You did very well on that hole. Though, and that, you know, I can't beat that when you have a great second try like that. Well, I was lucky with the drive, I suppose, and got away with it with the driver. Got, but I got away with it with the driver. Recover but with managed the to recover with the second shot. So this is not your favourite hole, which is the 18th, as people would have no. seen. If, if we did a series of it. my least favourite hole... This is your least favourite hole. This quite possibly... Woohoo, I might need it. ...would be it. Okay, so 200 and a little it's, bit. It's just over 200 yards. Okay. And it is a tough par 3. It's supposed to be a par 3, isn't it? But yeah. oh, Everything on. goes left to right. Seriously, yeah. Yeah, you've got... I do believe they still kept the bunker short of the green. I think they have. And you've got a mound that runs around the left-hand side, kicks balls to the right. Just off the right... You've got into no man's land, which is yep. just like a little gorsy area. Uh, just up there is a little stone. But yeah, it's a tough par three. It's tough, and it? yeah, it's hard one. This. Yeah. Do your best. Right. It's bouncing a lot, so I've got a five iron, and just okay. hope that. Left is good for this, really. I suppose of anything. Well, sort of. Not really left, but. Okay. I'm going. Stupid, but I'm aiming at the bunker. Yeah, I was going to say that's probably a good plan, actually, isn't it? I get this way. Well, I think you've swung out left. Yeah, it's left, it's bounced, I can see it. Okay. Just a very poor swing. Very poor swing. It's out there though. It's out there. So I'm going to go driver because it's a You're long way up. You're going to go up. driver. It is a long way up there. I've got my little tee, my little pink one. Your little pink. Just gone to the rolled off to the right of the bunker. Okay. Just short of the green, so that was a great shot. That was great for me. So I think a slight advantage to you there. Slight advantage. Because you're uh, you're just playing straight into the green, where I've got to play over a little bit of uh, lumpy bumpy stuff. Little lumpy bumpy stuff. We'll have a look. So while Neil tucks his uh, self into his trousers, we were in tight. You don't have a backside, mate. I don't. No, so it doesn't, you know, you can't keep it all in on, the, on that okay. belt. Back, leg. Exactly, yep. yeah. Please discuss. Please, <laughs> so, please don't. Please no. don't. so, Nils in a little bit of rough stuff, and uh, here's the green to go to. Okay, so a bit of bunker. I'm just here on the right, which I'm quite happy with. That's not too bad at all. So, a bit of a look, because again, it's one of those ones with a slope on it. And if you go too hard, you're going to roll off the front and possibly the back. So, hmm. we'll have a look. I need to aim left and let it roll. You do. No. Has he hit that hard enough? No, he hasn't. No, he hasn't. Ooh, I don't know where that's gone. You did say this is your least favourite hole. Yeah. So we'll walk up because I need to see where that, what's happened to that. That looked a bit messy. I want to get in. I just want to go drive down 
So, you uh, you just landed in the ridge, didn't you? Yeah, I something at the moment with my short game is just gone, but. And it's normally what saves you all the time. Normally, my recoveries, yeah. Right. Better and the slope. Even that's wadi. I'm gonna be right on the slope. We'll take it. We'll take you it. Take it. Oh, it's on the green. You've got to take that. Yeah, I got a putt. I got a putt from that. We keep going. No, I said I used to run down there on cross country. Well, trot. You, you say trot run down there. Yeah, I didn't yeah. run down there. Yeah. Do I look like I'm built for running? No, I was built for fighting. That's why I went into martial arts. I was built for fighting and yeah. throwing, not for running. I don't know what I was built for. It was either stand your ground and hit people, John, or run, and I couldn't do the running bit. So. Call it a bit thin. A bit thin. But, stay there. Just up it off the bat. It's rolled Sometimes back onto the green. It doesn't matter how you get it there, as long as you get it there. Yeah, it's back on the green. Yeah, the intention was to do a dinky bump and run, yeah. but I ended up almost trying to want to do it in the air, and then it ended doing the bunk. But you're there little for dinky two. bump and run. I'm there for two. And I'm there for three. You are. Br you. Bring some putters. Bring some putters. I seriously need to try and win this hole because the next hole is Neil's favourite hole. You can see the video on the channel. Neil's favourite hole. So John's just on the sort of back edge. Give you quite an interesting putt down. It's all downhill, sloping from his right. Mm, isn't it it? Caught the grass again. Yeah. Oh, hey. You didn't quite catch that one right. Okay, so I shall put that one. Yeah, carry on. Right, so we're level, yeah? Well, yeah, you've got a shot still, so still your advantage, sir. Not much of one now, though. Right. You can help me off that? No, yeah, it's not. Yeah, well, no, you're going to have had it. Yeah, well done. Right. Okay. Thank you. A bit of pressure on him, but not as much as I'd like to have put on him. I still need to toll this one, don't I, though? Well, don't know. I must admit, I, don't, I am carrying it off too busy looking at the view, a, mate. You had a five for five note four, and I got this with a four. Okay. Got the line. Again, got the line, but not the power. Last few holes, we've been struggling with putting. Right at the start of these three videos, we're doing okay, yeah. but now. Things got very slow again. I think it's a little bit of sort of dew in the air. Yeah. Just holding on the greens and just a little bit of growth as well. It happens. So yeah, I spoke to the greenkeepers here and yeah. they say that um, the grass is a little bit long on the greens right now. They're trying to protect them from the rigors of the weather. Yeah, with, with the, severe the heat weather of the wind, here. just burns them off straight away. Yeah, it does here. Yeah. As you can see, why? I mean, come on. View might be beautiful, but it's not good if you're a greenkeeper. No, no. So. One up. One up. Last hole. Last hole. Your favourite hole. My favourite hole, so in theory... In theory you should win it. We drew after the front line. We did, yeah. Level. Can you do it again? Can I do it again? We'll find out. Not if I'm hitting it left. True. Right. Last hole, John. Last hole. Let's let's do it. Still one up. Still one up to you. Hanging on. Right. So, tell us about the 18th, but they don't really need to tell them much. Told everybody on your favourite. Yeah, hole. yeah, we, we will put a link on it to make sure you watch it. Please go and watch it. Yeah, it's a it's a tricky hole. You played it very well, though. I did, yeah. I thought I managed to scramble a par, but this hole is par five, 483 yards off the yellow, and we are going down between this uh, gap in the hedge. That then goes downhill, kinks to the left, and you go out to the green down there Sounds so yeah easy. it does sound easy but you got no. for me i've got out of bounds left to worry about yeah so uh and also out of bounds right yeah for me so. well you're one up sir so I, i'll look forward then the honor is yours
great tee shot. Yeah, happy with that. Yeah, you want to take that one every day of the week? Your turn. Don't think you can go wrong there. Not by trying to put pressure on you, but that wasn't a bad tee shot, even for me. Well, that was a good one. That was a very it good one. It was straight. Might not have the distance you can hit, but it was straight. Yeah, well, Which, until now, you haven't been. No, distance isn't so. everything, though. Where you can put it, mate, not where you whack it. Right. Ah, oh, he's really bombed that one. That's over. That's over the right-hand side, which will be perfectly safe. I'm hoping I've cut the corner enough. Yeah, the, the way you normally drive a ball, that'll cut the corner. A little bit wayward, but I think I might have got away with got it. Got away with that one. Well done. A little bit unlucky, John. Just found the. The yeah, right of the rough. rough. If it had been there, yeah, a little bit further. There, it would have been into the middle of the fairway because yeah. it rolls off, doesn't it? So I, I, I've got a Cornish hedge, mate. But it was a, it was a good strike, which yeah. I think is the main thing is to get the ball struck struck well. So again, it's getting over this wall. Right, so he's going seven iron to clear it over. Yeah, that'll do you. Uh, hopefully that's left enough to just kick and run down the fairway. Yeah, admittedly, you know, I've got a bit safer to seven and people have said, oh, why don't you take a longer club? Because I'm not hitting them very high and that's just yeah. another big obstacle for me. It's a confidence thing, but I'm over. We keep going. Okay, Neil, so while you uh, inspect where you are and what you're going to do next, that's the uh, where basically we teed off from and that's the, the stuff that Neil has avoided. Yeah, well done. Cleared the corner. Yeah, so we're going to swing this round. I'm on the fairway, we think. Uh, which is kind of where I hope to be in my next shot. Neil, it's got a good line in. Yeah. Big shot though. Big shot. This is, as we said, this is the scary shot really, because if you hook him badly left, yeah. there's windows and buildings and there's why someone ever built a conservatory. I have no idea. No. I'd have never built a conservatory there. But they did. Right. It's all or nothing really. So well, you've got to win the hole. I've got three wood. Got the three wood out. Go on. Man, he's bombed it to the right. Over on that right hand side. Yeah, that'll which, be alright. Which is a very safe shot. I, I'm, I'm focusing probably on the fountain. This is new. Yeah, fountain. yeah, new I fountain. Love the fountain. I know. It does look good. To be fair, I think that was part of me trying not to hit it left. Yeah. I have course. been hitting it left most of the day. Yeah, that was a very scary shot for you all of a sudden. Yeah, mm. but I've managed to lay it in a position now where I'm pitch across. Absolutely. So, we go and find mine, and then we play yours. Say the distance there. So you got, I think got about 170. Yeah, I've still got the corner to worry about. I'm yeah. going to go up here. I'm probably going towards the fountain of the bunker. And, and like I think it's safe place, yeah, left edge of that line. bunker. You're about 170, John. Yeah, so just the five iron get a bit closer. Yeah. Just space. before the bunker. Yeah. We were just saying, you just don't want to go no. anything left. I mean, just if you don't. look at where you're, where you're playing into the green, I mean, down this left side, you've got, you've got, to cut, I've got houses, to cut the shed. conservatories. If I was really going for the green, I've got to cut the shed. Yeah, you've got to sort of cut over like the hedge there, the little fence. Yeah. So the safe play is what you did and played it outright to yeah. play into the green. Let's get to the next ball. I've just got to play to draw this hole. And that's what I'm trying to do. Um, I didn't have to go for anything particularly serious. Just hope the next shot's going to be okay. Well, so John's just managed to lay up short of this bunker. He's got 91 in. Flags tucked on the right-hand side of the green there. Going left of the green. Kind of on the green, it's hold. very long, it might just sweep off the left. It's just dropped off the edge. Be alright. Be okay. Yeah, that was yeah. a good, good shot from there. It was a shot from there. I'm not saying it was a good one, but yeah, it's what it is right now. Near the end of the day. Oh, it's a lovely smell of fish oh, and chips going from somewhere. Scampy. It's sc it's scampy, it's scampy mm. last time, wasn't it? Yeah. What if it's scampy not on a Monday here? Um, you were so close to the end of your game, Nick. Oh, I know. Uh, <laughs> 
if you wonder what the noise is, it's the latest addition to Cape Cornwall Club. Brilliant. This is the Crocodile Creek, but they've got a fountain. Oh, I love a fountain, mate. Love a fountain. I uh, don't like a fountain when I've drunk a, you know, parade on the way around. No, no. But this is different. But if ever there should be a problem now, that'll be it. You cross your legs with a fountain next to you. Uh, so, you, oh, you nearly were too good then. I know, I, I hit the three woods. I thought, I didn't think it would quite go as far, but it flew out yeah. of that rock. Hmm, it's hot and vinegar now. Oh. Oh. oh, it's a windy element. I'm starving. Hang on. Oh. Neil, you've got what it. You've had a couple of those today. I know. That's not good, mate. Yeah. What's going on? Uh, so, you've got another go, mate. All right. Take it again. Let's have a. You've had a couple of these kind of. I've had a couple of those. Almost sort of strange like... little soft dust with you today, yeah. which is not like your game at not all. Not like my pitching. normal game. All right, come on, Neil. Better. Can you get one out a bit too firm? Better. A little bit firm. Plenty of work to go on that yet. Bit of meat left going, on that right? bone. Yeah. Is this your favourite hole? It was. Yeah, I think they've been put up by the fountain. I have, yeah. Yeah. You've got a little bit of background noise now because we've got a vent going on, which is... It's funny where they're doing the cooking. That's why I can smell it so nicely. Right. The closer I'm getting, the better it's smelling. Yeah. That's just me, mate. That's me after say. Right. So I'm going to put it because, well, I think this is, I think this is still classed as, well, I don't know, would it be classed as the You're green? You're just off the green. Yeah. We'll call it fringe. 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 I like fringe. Not bad. Oh, good. Not bad. Good line. Yeah, good line. I thought you'd done one of your miracle putts. Yeah, again. I thought I had to then. I was looking at it thinking, oh, well, no, no, it could go. But the greens are a little bit slower than we were expecting. It's okay. We keep going on. And on, and on. So, I'm actually walking backwards right now, not seeing what's on the screen. Hopefully I've got Neil. There we go. Right, come on. Come on, Nelly. Give it a whack. They needed to. Ooh. A little bit. Yeah, finish off, mate. A little bit fiery. If you finish off, I know what I gotta do. If I gotta do anything at all. If you gotta do anything at all, yeah. If I've gotta do anything at all. If you gotta do anything at all. Right. I think we can have a, have a count say. on the abacus, mate. I think I think we can safely say well, you've have, got. Have a count. I like I like to count. You know, I'll have a count. There you go, six net five wins it okay. for John. I think hey, that any day of the week right here. Good win, sir. Good Thank win. you very much. Hey, I actually, I actually win a competition. I actually won the hole over 18 as well. Drew on the front nine. Drew on the front. Win on the back nine. Well played, sir. Well played. Oh, that's what happened one day in my life. Good, a good day. Not necessarily the best golf all the time, but sometimes it doesn't have to be good to win, does it? So, not that I'm competing, you understand. Right, we'll just move out the way of the... Uh, little venting system and we'll say goodbye right then Neil that's the end of part three that was the end of part three and very well played thank you very much you, sir. Um, far away close up not giant and mini all right sorry oh. distance and everything Short, for, called for shortening on a, on a camera <laughs> so thank you very much to Cape Cornwall Club for allowing us to come and play uh, they've been they've been really good with us for the last couple of weeks. To, like, we just appear on a, on a Monday evening and go, can we just come and play and can we just take a buggy and whatever? And they've been brilliant to allow us to do that. We've tried to show the course as best we can right now. I know our game is not as good as it should be no. at times, but this is the sort of course that does that to you. Yeah. It can beat you no, up no, very right. quickly. Yeah. yeah, I mean, playing here as a junior, there's a lot of memories for me now going around and it, it can beat you up. You can go around and have a good round. I've been around here, you know, in single, single digits over par but it can kick you in the behind. Yeah, you can lose a ball very yeah, easily here, yeah, and some definitely. of the slopes are, are wicked. Definitely. Um, so you will be seeing quite a lot of Cape Cornwall Club, because obviously I live very near here, and I'll be coming down and doing some bits of filming with you as well, yeah. and myself. 
and sometimes we'll be playing proper chorus vlogs sometimes it'll just be little bits of practice and stuff so we're all done here yeah. we're off to loo in two days time to film off to the loo yeah, Definitely. You, might, you might need one. He's been struggling. I'm going to talk for a long time very slowly because he wants to go to the loo and be next to that, um, oh, that lovely fountain. new fountain. Yeah. Tinkle, 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 mate. I know, yeah. Oh, brilliant it is. I've got to do a slow-mo of, of the fountain now. Just for you. I mean, it's sort of on... <laughs> when it comes to our golf today we're, we're both sort of working progresses with our swings we're yeah. both receiving lessons and trying different things so, i think that's what this whole scene's about i yeah. said to you just as we finished it's not always about how good the game is right now it's yeah. just about enjoying the fact yeah. that we can because after last year when we couldn't really do anything and most no, people no. couldn't do anything and even for part of this year when people couldn't do anything it's just good to be back on the course and it's, we'll get better and we'll get better over the winter a year and of progression i mean you know a lot of people have commented that your game's improved a lot and it really has yeah there's there have been some good you're, bits today you're striking the ball so much better at times your approach shots are much better you know it's it's getting i'm getting better. more confident yeah, yeah you are yeah. definitely and you just need to fix that swing again go i back just and need see to we're in that mental really attitude look. again i need him to stand behind me every time i hit a bad one even hit me on the back of the head with an eight he does really want to go to the loop but he just won't shut up i know so Please subscribe, please hit the notification bell, do all those things and come and join me and my wife Kelly and probably Neil and Eddie and a few other people when we get some more videos out on the new channel that we've got which is called Big Oggy Cornwall and uh, it's like the sister channel of this. It'll be, there won't be much golf on it but it'll be lots of Cornwall, yeah. lots of beautiful views like this and places we're going to go to. So, bye for now everybody. We will see you on another video very soon. Wave Neil. Thanks for watching. Bye everybody, bye bye. bye.